Hey guys, what's going on? It's Island Wolf and Black Ops 3 was just confirmed yesterday. So today I decided that I'm gonna tell you guys what I want to see in Black Ops 3 for zombies and multiplayer. This is just my opinion. Feel free to disagree. You know, tell me what you want to see in Black Ops 3 in the comment section down below. And yeah. So let's start with zombies since that's a little bit shorter. For zombies, basically I just want to see, you know, good default maps. Cause transit was shit. I hated that. You know, the only map I really played was town, maybe sometimes farm for variety. But you know, really good default maps like they had in Black Ops 1. Kino was so much fun. I love that. So yeah. Also, I want some cool guns, you know, some wonder weapons, some awesome things, you know, like the Thunder Gun, Wonder Waffle, Return of the Ray Gun, you know, a better version of the Ray Gun, something like that. Just cool guns, cool camels and all that. And lastly for zombies, I would like to see some new pack-a-punch mechanics like you know how in custom zombies, if you guys ever watched that, that sometimes you could double pack a punch, get a new element for your gun, and it refills your ammo. Well, I think it was cool that they could do that. They did it in town, but it just changed the optic of the gun. It didn't really alter the damage or change anything about it. It didn't give you more ammo or anything. So if they could add that, that would be awesome. Now let's get into multiplayer since I think that's what everybody wants to know about and all that. But I think about it. Well, one, you know, I want good gun variety, I want good gun balance, I want to be able to, you know, use different guns, not just use the same guns over and over again, like, you know, we all know the same guns, everybody used the AN-94, the SCAR, all that stuff, you know, I love the SCAR, I love the AN-94, but sometimes you guys switch it up and use other guns and all that, but, you know, gun balance is a really big thing about it, you gotta make sure your guns are balanced, that, you know, there is not one gun that everybody uses, like, fucking in advanced warfare, so, <laughs> make sure the gun balance is good. Next thing. What I want to see is basically, you know, good default maps. Black Ops 2 did it well. You know, I want to see the return of Ray, Standoff, Nuketown. I want to see those come back and, you know, add some fun game modes into it. Add some new game modes. We bring back Hardpoint, please. Please bring back Hardpoint. Bring back Demo. I miss Demo. They didn't have it for the last two CODs, which, you know, kind of sucks. I love Demo. So please bring that back. Now, here's the really big thing about COD, the kill streaks. Everybody loves kill streaks. Kill streaks is what make COD, you know, semi-enjoyable, right? So one thing they must, must, must do is at least bring in a Moab or something. Like, you know, nuclears are fine, they're whatever, but everybody loves Moabs and all that, trying to get Moabs with different things and all that, calling them in, destroying the enemy team. It's just, it's fun. That would make it more enjoyable. So please, Treyarch, please make something like that like a nuke or something and bring it into the game because you didn't have it for black ops 1 you didn't have it for black ops 2 please please for black ops 3 have a nuke now let's get into actual kill streaks like you know the kill streaks you call in on that so basically what i want to see for those type of kill streaks for the low kill streaks you know for the people who can't really get the big kill streaks all the time you know i want some good low streaks you know the lightning straight hailstorm that was pretty good you know that was good it wasn't too annoying it wasn't too bad so I think that's a good like that was a good balance. The kill streak balance in Black Ops 2 was really good. I liked it. The low streaks, you know, they weren't that bad. They weren't that annoying. It was okay. The high streaks. Now for the high streaks, I want some really badass, you know, destroying the enemy team spawn, you know, making them cry, dashboard, all that shit. I want some high streaks like that. That's what I want to see in Black Ops 3. Some big ass streaks that you know takes a while to get. And you get it and then you just destroy the fucking enemy team. That's what I like. That's the type of shit I like. There was probably a few things that I missed, like, you know, the spawning system and the hit detection slash lag. You know, I hope they fix all of that. I hope theater mode is in there, but it doesn't have to be in there, I guess. But all in all, I could hope and wish all I want. We just gotta wait and see once we get the game, how the game would turn out. You know, we can't really go on anybody's opinion or whatever. We gotta see the game for ourselves and see how we like it individually. That's how we gotta go. I know the video is almost over, but let me talk about the gameplay real quick. This is a 78-5 headquarters gameplay on Plaza. I was playing with my friends. He was trying to support. I was using VSAT, Escort, Warhawk, whatever. I like those streaks. And basically, you can consider it a double nuclear fail, I guess, because I got on two Relentless. And these are the streaks you're watching right now. But anyways, guys, the World Reveal trailer will be out the 26th of this month. So, you know, stay tuned. Watch that. I'm definitely going to be watching it. I might make a video the day after talking about it. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like if you're excited for Black Ops 3. I know I am. I'm excited for the World Reveal trailer to see what's going to happen, see what they're going to show us and all that. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. You know, what you're excited for, what do you want to see in Black Ops 3 and all that. And subscribe if you're new. I'll tell you guys next time. Peace. Black Ops 3. Let's go.